massive storms in less than a week hit Moab hard. Yesterday, the town picked up 0.6 inches of rain in just 15 minutes. Now, that's down from the inch they received last Friday, but still enough to cause some flooding and other damage. Yeah, it's a headache. David Acho is live tonight in Moab, where he spoke to people after yet another round of that heavy rain. David, how are people feeling tonight? Well, back-to-back -back weekends of storm cleanup has a lot of people and even the mayor wondering, is this the new normal? And they're wondering what can be done to solve this problem. At nearly 11 p.m. Thursday night, Tim Miller is outside his restaurant on Main Street cleaning up after yet another storm in Moab. 15 minutes of rain. It's flooded all the sidewalks. It's pretty crazy. Other businesses on Maine had sandbags at their entrances or even closed up shop early because of the storm. Ever since the big storm in 2022, people are cautious anytime it rains. And two flooding events in a week only makes them more worried. I wouldn't be surprised if in my lifetime I see a wall of water 10 feet tall coming through town. The next morning, Marsha Uhl takes us down into her basement. It's relatively dry now, but on Thursday night, it had two feet of water in it. It was just above my knee, so yeah, yeah, that's still pretty current. Just like Tim, she was up late cleaning, but it could be worse. She showed us how high the water has gotten in the past. She's hoping the city can come up with a solution to the problem. I think they need to get their engineering and figure out how to rebuild the stormwater to be current with uh, with our climate now and, and what can happen. I sat down with the mayor and asked her what they can do. So what's the plan? What is the city going to do about all this? Good question. Uh, we're going to have to do some really serious planning on how we're going to manage the drainage, the Mill Creek drainage through the middle of town. Langanese says it's going to take a lot of work, engineering and money to fix some of the problems. I don't know what it's going to look like in the future. You know, everything that we need to do is going to cost us a lot of money. And the mayor hopes that the state can give them some help with some of these problems. Reporting live from Moab, David Ochoa, KUTV 2 News.